just as I thought after Aiden Ross had to be the one who was stupid enough to not learn about the DMC law, EMAD, unfortunately, is one of them. I don't know how, but it is kind of uh, interesting that he's only 20 years old, and I thought that at his school at the time, he's supposed to know everything. But I guess since he dropped out of school, I guess, I think, or or since he graduated from school, but yet he decides to do lots and lots of Fortnite streams, like 14 to 18 hours of streaming a day. Whenever he plays the game himself or watch does a Fortnite watch party, which goes on for as long as 14 to 18 hours, it kind of makes him look a little bit dumb because tweeted, the MCA is the stupidest thing ever. We aren't promoting music for free. Hello. We aren't claiming shit. It's actually hell annoying. Get your shit together. And, well, Emad, actually, <laughs> it looks like you need to get your shit together because you practically don't know about this law and the history of it. I mean, come on. You've been... You've been ratioed in the comments by many, many people. You've been doing that. You've been doing that because you don't know these laws. I'm going on the way down because you kind of aren't educated on this reason. I mean, seriously. How could you not know these laws? They exist for a reason. It happened since, like, I think 1998 or 1994. And if you think you can like pl play music that you don't own think again because I think everybody who's smarter than you can actually see that and you know Twitch has to go by these rules you literally cannot just stream a song that you like to listen to that you don't own just because you are not a music label company. Music label companies tend to do that. And I'm going to show you this real quickly. YouTube, all the way back in 2007, was sued by Viacom, along with Google, for copyright infringing their work. And that's when the whole copyright thing started on YouTube. And now it's Twitch's turn, which is why Twitch does now be the next YouTube. And if you know how bad the Twitch streamers feel, the YouTube YouTubers feel today, then you would fall through and not do this type of shit. And as always, competitive players have the shittiest tanks, exactly. At the end of the day, you're not just promoting someone's music for free, you're literally pirating pirating someone's content. In that case, the music labels content. You're literally pirating that, and it's against these laws.